Hey, what's up? So in this video, we're going to prove that the cosine of iz is equal to cosine z, and the cosine of iz is equal to cosine z. So here, z is a complex number. So basically, these equations relate the hyperbolic cosine to the um, regular cosine, right? So um, these are complex valued functions, right? So for a complex number, the cosine of iz is equal to cosinch and cosinch is equal to cosine in this, in this sense. Basically, um, when you plug in iz into either cosine or cosinch, the i goes away. It's an i killer, right? Uh, it just goes away and you get the other one. So it turns into the other one, right? It's kind of cool, right? You plug in iz into the cosine and your cosine function turns hyperbolic. You plug in iz into your hyperbolic function, and it turns into a regular, you know, trig function. Um, let's let's go through the proof. Before we do, though, we do have to recall uh, the definitions. So I'm going to go ahead and recall what that is. So the definition of the complex cosine is the following. So cosine z is uh, equal to um, e to the iz, okay, plus e to the negative iz over two. So this is the the complex valued. Uh, cosine function and the hyperbolic cosine function so cosinch of z this will be e to the z plus e to the negative z all over two so this is the hyperbolic cosine uh, function so now we have to just prove these so let's let's do it let's go through the proofs let's start with this one i'll call this one one we'll call this one two and and we'll just do it so proof now i haven't done this before making this video. I usually don't usually just make the videos. Um, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, kind of exciting. Let's start with this and show it's equal to this. So cosine of iz. I think it's better to figure it out on the spot, right? Because that way you see and you learn how to do it. So the cosine of iz. So basically we just have to replace all of the z's here with iz's. So this is going to be, let's see, e to the i, iz. And you can skip steps, but Again, I haven't done this, so I'm just going to replace all of the z's here with with iz's. So we put an we put an iz here, we put an iz here. Life is good. Now I'm going to skip some steps. I times i is i squared, right? So that's negative one, right? Remember, i squared is negative one. So this is e to the negative z plus, and this is going to be uh, negative i squared. So it's negative i squared. So it's negative negative one, so it's one. So this is e to the z, right? This becomes e to the z. And it's over two. So let me rewrite this one more time. This is e to the z plus e to the negative z all over two. And that's the hyperbolic cosine of z. Boom, rush through it, but it's pretty easy, right? It's pretty easy. Uh, I think the one with sine and cinch is a little bit harder. So step one, you um, replace you replace z with iz, right? So we did that here. And then i times i is i squared, so that's negative one, that's how we get that. And this is a positive one, right? You see up here, it's a positive one. So we get that. All I did in this step is just switch these, okay? And then this is the def, oh, I switched them to make it match, to make it match this, right? And that's hyperbolic cosine. Let's do the second one, proof of two, let's do it. Proof of two. So this one, uh, we'll start with this and we'll show it's equal to this. So we have the hyperbolic cosine of iz, so cosinch iz. And so in this case, we simply have to replace uh, z with, with uh, iz, right? So this is going to be e to the iz, this is so awesome, plus e to the negative iz over 2. <laughs> it's immediate, right? It's it's completely immediate. That's it. We're done. That's equal to that. So really, really, really beautiful. What a proof. These are the best proofs in the world, right? Because they're so easy. The best proofs are the easy proofs. I, I don't care what anyone says. Simple is better in math, right? I mean, there's some really hard proofs that are really beautiful, but I, I think I meant to say simple is beautiful. So uh, really, really interesting um, identities. So yeah, that's it. Take care.